Roger McKenzie's season 4 finale's redemption may not have hit the mark as book readers cite that the Roger's fate gets even worse in the fiery cross. Outlander, season 4 made us rethink about a lot of characters and change popular opinions, one being that of Roger McKenzie, Richard Rankin, the 20th century Oxford professor and Brianna Fraser's, Sophie Skelton, love interest. His misogynistic ideas about marriage and sex made many fans loathe him last season, and though the season finale was his redemption, it did not quite hit the mark because chances are, fans are going to despise him even more in season 5. It is not unknown that Roger and Brianna have a toxic relationship, they can't stand being away from each other and neither can they stand to be together, at least in season 4. Season 5 will be based out of Diana Gabaldon's fifth book titled The Fiery Cross, and fans have cited concerns on how Roger will be portrayed because Season 4 based out of Drums of Autumn, supposedly had a subtle tone of this Scottish scholar, compared to the fifth book. So if the fourth season enraged the fans, imagine what fifth could do. In Season 4, Roger wanted to marry Brianna before having sex with her, and though that's justified because it's his beliefs. It was baffling when he slut-shamed Brianna for wanting to have sex with him. You don't want to marry me, but you left K me? He yelled in The False Bride. If all I wanted was to have my way with you, I would have had you on your back a dozen times last summer. Roger was slapped for his words and Brianna pointed out the sexist hypocrisy as to how it was okay for him to have slept with other women but it was wrong for a woman to do so. Despite time traveling for her and in Brianna's words pursuing her for 200 years, he still had not changed his mind about marrying Brianna as a virgin. After a brief hand-fasting session and intense lovemaking sesh, they fight again and are not reunited until the finale where Roger has been beaten to the pulp by Jamie Fraser, sold to the Mohawks of New York, who torture him even more and does not win the title as the ultimate man of worth since young Ian takes the crown. Jamie has already labeled Roger as a coward, who does not deserve his daughter, and though we are yet to see the Fraser's reaction to Roger's return, fans aren't impressed that he hesitated to return to Brianna in the first place after knowing that Stephen Bonnet had raped her. Now in the fiery cross, according to fans who have read the book, the history professor's stupidity is very apparent as he wanders more in the wilderness, continues the toxic relationship with Brianna and is in conflict with almost everything. Spoiler coming, in the books Roger is beaten again and hanged, but he survives. A Reddit user has boldly opined that it would have been better if he had died, much to the dismay of other fans, who despite disliking Roger, does not want him to die. Roger has always struck me as a bit of a blunderer, he makes stupid mistakes that get him into trouble, seriously, Roger? The user wrote. Suffice to say here that Roger McKenzie, not Richard Rankin, should mentally prepare to lose more fans. Added to that many fans have stated that The Fiery Cross, is the least favorite book of all Outlander series. Fiery Cross had to have been the most boring, longest book of the series so I hope the show doesn't make me fall asleep with three episodes of The Gathering or something, a user wrote. Roger fans, yes they exist are concerned about the upcoming season. The Alamance incident is in TFC. Poor poor Roger, I wonder if people will still think he deserves all the bad treatment, a user wrote.